So it's a fairly simple and straightforward um, model. It's taken from Sir John Whitmore in performance coaching, but I find that it is really very effective into any kind of coaching, any kind of conversations, by the way. I have a 17 year old who say, mom, la, 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 and say, what are you trying to accomplish? Oh, all I want is X. Okay, so what's the hesitation? What's surrounding? What is the reality surrounding? Well, my friends are not available on Wednesday. Right? So given that reality, what are your options? Start where you are with what you have and do what you can. By the way, I shouldn't steal that quote from Arthur Ashe. Arthur Ashe is the one who said that. Start where you are, use what you have, and do what you can. Right? And so the last question I would ask my daughter or my client or my CEO. So, 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 so given those options, what's realistic for you to start on? What will you do this Monday? Kind of funnel it down to this is what I will do, given all the reality that I have on hands. And some of these realities is not your fault. Like Laura said, that's just the, the shift in the market. But given that reality, what is still in my power to do. Make sense? Yeah, all right. So I hope to see you again next time so that we can at least you know, um, follow up on what progress have you made? What, what have you tried? Anything you try would be progress, by the way. Anything you try would be more thing, one more thing that you haven't done today. So anything that you have tried would be progress, okay? All right. Upon this, my friends, I will turn it back over to Laura. Thank you. Laura. So I'm going to put Han's contact information in the chat. So the every time I talk to Han, I always like it's all just working in my brain. Like I'm I'm not ready to necessarily ask questions at that moment, but I ponder and then I think of stuff. So if you're like me, you're going to have questions for Han in like two hours. So. Make sure you just note her contact info. She is the best person to ask questions to and just kind of go back and forth because she always asks something that makes me think of it differently, um, which can be really helpful. If you're looking for a place to start to, I would break it down further and further until you're at a more bite-sized piece. So if you're at that moment of like, I don't even know what I want to do with my job, that's when you need to break it down further of thinking like, what do I actually like to do? What are some of my skills or hobbies? What would be amazing if I could turn it into a job? Or even like my friend always does something cool. I'm curious what they're up to. So um, this is kind of like a, a nice way to continue working after this.